People are going to have to get used to not seeing fruit and vegetables the way they're used to seeing them now because it will be unsustainable. Some of the challenges this company is trying to tackle are, are major issues and we need everybody getting together and being really creative about how we solve this problem. We're not just going to try and take on the world individually, we're going to try and do it together. So we're not focused just on our area, we're actually looking at the bigger picture, sort of the wider picture. I consider New Zealand, particularly Tauranga, as a, as a bit of a lab. We can bring some really great bits of technology and, and work together because, I mean, collectively we're stronger. No matter where, you can just call people up and they're happy to give advice or be involved in new and interesting things. That's just amazing to me that you can do that out here on a small island in the South Pacific. We're in a race to ultimately give the consumer the best that we can. We're constantly reinventing what we do all the time. We're impatient. What we're doing is we're stepping out of a really nice, clean, industrial environment like a, a workshop or something like that. You have to be out in the orchards. You can't develop that technology in a lab. You know, I just get blown away by the talent that is in New Zealand. The products and product systems that we design are actually solving a problem. Actually helping solve real industry challenges. Pretty cool step to see that technology running like that. We really want to develop a globally relevant, world leading robotics entity. Today's already happened. You can't change it. You can learn from it and take those lessons, but keep looking forward.